Welcome to the second video in our new series, Burning with Intelligence. Today we're going to be going through our latest exhaust gas analyzer, the Mark 8 EJ Evo. We'll be going through exactly what the EJ can measure, O2 versus three parameter trim, where savings can be made, different operating modes, environmental reporting, and combustion limits. The EGA is a continuous emissions monitoring system, measuring and storing emissions data of up to six gases for three years. A wet sample is extracted from the boiler stack through the sampling probe and tubing and analyzed by the EGA. The EGA measures, as standard, O2, CO, CO2, and NO emissions in the flue gases. Optionally, NO2 and SO2 cells can be installed. NOx is comprised of around 95% NO and 5% NO2, so if accurate NOx measurement and reporting is necessary, then the NO2 cell is required. Otherwise, the EGA will calculate the NOx from the NO. We would recommend the SO2 cell for high sulfur content fuels, such as heavy oils. In standalone mode, a 4 to 20 milliamp input from a fuel flow meter can be wired directly into an EGA for more accurate fuel usage. There are also six dedicated 4 to 20 milliamp outputs from the EJ, which allows extraction of certain parameters, such as emissions levels, temperatures, and so forth. Now, the EJ Evo now has direct Modbus. This allows access to some more of the EJ's data, such as gas concentrations, temperatures and efficiencies, and EGA error codes. When coupled with an MM combustion controller, such as the Mark 8 MM or the Mini Mark 8 MM, a number of additional features can be enabled. Three parameter trim can be implemented, yielding increased safety and around 1-2% to fuel savings. Combustion and temperature limits can also be set up, which ensures the burner locks out or warning is generated once these limits have been exceeded. The Autoflame system trims on O2, CO and CO2, and so is not simply an O2 trim system. Without cross-referencing CO and CO2, even if your O2 levels are correct, Changes in ambient conditions can cause your CO levels to rise significantly. Now, another more dangerous problem that can occur is oxygen being induced into the boiler through gaskets and small gaps in your boiler flue. This is called trampair. Now, because the gas emissions are measured at the exit of the boiler, this trampair can cause your O2 levels to rise significantly, even if you have good combustion. With the Autoflame EGA, O2, CO, and CO2 are constantly being measured. So any changes in these three parameters results in a combustion trim taking place on either the air damper or the VFD in order to bring the combustion levels back to the original commission values. Now, whether you've got the EGA in standalone mode or coupled with an MM controller, combustion data such as emissions concentrations and gases, efficiencies, fuel usage, temperatures, pressures, all of this can be extracted into a CSV file for user-definable time periods. The EGA can also be integrated with our data transfer interface, the DTI, which we'll cover in a later video, for more advanced Modbus and data logging capabilities. So there'll be many more videos to come, so stay tuned for more intelligent answers to burning questions.